Hi, despite the stories about Farage being pro-Putin, an abundance of outed racist sexist candidates standing, then denounced by Reform UK, has any of this damaged their electoral chances? I say not. The Farage Reform UK surge will not even be slightly dented by these or further revelations. It's like a Frankenstein creation running amok, smashing through the stifling consensus, lib lab con conformity, part of the growing right-wing populist worldwide ballot box insurgency, itself representing part of the crumbling capitalist system. In spite of being another false alternative, Farage and Reform UK has successfully tapped into the right-wing populist zeitgeist. With only three days to go, how far will reform progress electorally? Is it possible they can win more than just Farage's clactancy? That their votes could be counted in the millions rather than the hundreds of thousands? Well, we'll see no. Why do I, an unremitting anarcho, show so much interest in this election and Reform UK in particular and Farage? Because for regular viewers over the years, I've been mentioned the great political void for umpteen vidcasts that with a lack of grassroots working class anti-capitalist alternatives this will be eventually filled by the populist right and this could be just the beginning in truth no one has any viable answers to the myriad of serious economic social structural problems that now constitute a national and global crisis an establishment that has run out of innovational solutions here and internationally to save their system. Our only hope is that an, an, an anarchic revolutionary current will develop from the bottom upwards to combat all this growing authoritarianism, create real alternatives. Voting under such circumstances will hardly even come into the equation. Bye.